Rather than work or, di or discuss any problems out of chapter 5.5, .5, what we're going to do is just work some problems. So let's look first at number 18. This is very similar to example number 5. If we can just work these problems, we've got the concept. Log of x plus 5 plus log of x minus 10 is equal to 3. Going back to page 380, some of our properties of logarithms, we see here we got a log. And, and what we, the book's telling you here is if it doesn't give you a base, it's a common logarithm. It's implied that the base is 10. So we see these bases are the same. Therefore, we can do something with them. So we got log of A plus log of B here. So that's log of A times B equals 3. Now, since this is log base 10, remember I can push the 10 over here and push the 3 up, giving me x plus 5 times x minus 10 equals 10 cubed. I move the base 10 over here, and I got the equation. I've got rid of the logarithm issue. Now I've just got a situation where I need to wind up with a quadratic equation in which I need to solve for x.